Chris here, CaribbeanPod.com. Welcome to my kitchen. Yes, we are in the kitchen today. However, we're not cooking. We're gonna do this tag thing everyone seems to be doing on YouTube. I mean to say, the foodies, we've gotta get involved too. We've got those people doing the draw my life. My boyfriend does the makeup. Foodies, so our tag is what's in my fridge. So today I'm gonna show you guys what's in my fridge. From time to time I get emails and stuff like that. Chris, what does your fridge look like? So here we go, what's in my fridge? Now, the very first thing you're gonna see is soda. And I am not a soda drinker. I do like juices, and we have a certain person in this house has a weakness for Coke. But I'm not into the sodas and stuff like that, so we'll just move over. We've got some fine filtered milk here, as well as we've been trying this new organic milk, and I'm telling you, it is absolutely delicious in tea. That's the only way I have milk. <laughs> I don't like milk. But in my tea, it is wicked. Let's move that down for a second. We've got some lemonade, and this Tropicana brand is amazing. Um, we've got some pickles back there, some pasta sauce, um, a beer. I think that's one of the beer. I think I have another one. Taya brought this back for me from uh, from Belgium when she was out there. And my thing, water. That this Brita comes in so handy. I hate disposing of bottles, so we've um, we've gone to. Uh, using the um, the Brita. Up here now I have um, tears into um, honeydew. So I've got some honeydew all cut up and everything there for her. Back there my find, I was at a Polish um, supermarket and I found this sour cherry jam and it is absolutely delicious. Back here I made some um, pineapple cranberry sauce that's been sitting there for a while now. I've got here some uh, some pink grapefruit marmalade that was out of the UK. Um, some little packs of peaches. And you know you're from the Caribbean. We always have our containers with leftover food. Some fry aloo, which is pretty much potato fried down with garlic and onion and stuff like that. Some green apples. Um, fresh tomatoes out of my garden. These are grape tomatoes cream for my coffee, half of a cabbage back there, more leftover food, and this was um, some pasta sauce, some meat sauce I made. I've got some garlic all peeled up back there. And way to the back, I've got a whole bunch of different cheeses, um, grated cheeses. So I've got some goat cheese, some Parmesan, as well as um, uh, some Roman. We have some golden ray butter. You gotta have that, that butter. I've got some tomato paste in a tube. We've got here some um, some feta, more butter, coconut cream, some wonton wrappers, and a whole assortment of condiments and pickles and stuff like that. You know you have to be, when you're from the Caribbean, you've got that green seasoning um, already made there. Ketchup, another weakness. Trini people love the ketchup. Um, soy sauce, hoisin sauce, a whole bunch of different sauces. More whipping cream some chipotle sauce, another weakness in this house, and that is um, maple syrup. I'm not a huge fan of mayonnaise, but I do like the tanginess of Miracle Whip. Up here, I've got some molasses, some homemade pepper sauce, and um, more Parmesan. Oh, grated Parmesan and Romano. My fridge is yelling at me to close the door. Fresh beans out of my garden, Romano beans. Um, some unsalted butter back there, some lemongrass, cucumber, and that's an English cucumber. More leftovers, and this is just rice. I'm going to be doing um, a fried rice with this pretty soon. Um, my favorite, um, pears. This is my snack. Way back there, we've got a butternut squash, and this fridge is really yelling at me now. Some organic eggs, margarine. Down in the drawer here, we've got fresh thyme, a bitter melon, some of my good friends, these little Thai chilies or bird's eye chili. We call them bird pepper in the Caribbean. Some little dill cucumbers. Oh, can't miss this guy. This is um, packaged, but in here I've got some salted cod. I think I have another package of salt. Yeah, there we go. This one is um, salted Alaskan pollock. Yukon gold potatoes, some shallots, 
sweet potato, fresh lemons, well not fresh, but lemons, we got some limes in here as well. Somewhere in here I have ginger, so usually you'll find ginger And there. the final draw, Caribbean sunshine, scotch bonnet peppers, I've got some uh, Boston lettuce, my favorite Boston uh, lettuce. We've got some scallions, celery, more cabbage. So we've got some cabbage, we've got carrots, and we've got these organic baby carrots I picked up. Uh, we were down in London, Ontario recently, and these are on sale. I picked those up. And a piece of red or purple cabbage. So this is pretty much what our fridge looks like. So there you go guys, you took an inside look at what's inside our fridge, hashtag what's in my fridge. And now I'm gonna call some names, some other foodies. I'd love for you guys to get involved. I mean, I say it's totally up to you. It's all about fun. We've got Chef Kendra, um, Laura from Laura in the Kitchen, Aliyah from uh, the Moroccan Channel, Cooking with Aliyah, um, Rob from Nico's Kitchen, Chef John from Food Wishes, Helen from Helen Recipes, you gotta check out that site, boy. She's doing some amazing things with Vietnamese food. Uh, my friend over at Smoky Ribs, Danny from Clean and Delicious, Julie from Cooked by Julie, and all you foodies out there, come on, share them on. Show us what you got in the fridge. Chris here, CaribbeanPod.com. Always a pleasure to have you guys here in the kitchen with me. I'm gonna go drink me a beer now. Have a good one.